human beings are naturally uh, inclined to re refuse or resist something that doesn't work. If you went to a, a let's say a, a soda pop machine and you put in a quarter or whatever and you hit the button and nothing comes out and you do it four or five times eventually you begin to catch on this is not working and so you withhold your money and you walk away from the machine and in some cases you may even address the machine in a very unhealthy way you know maybe hit it or say something to it because the machine had no results for you but well, that's what prayer is for most people they tried it they tried it they tried it no results no results so eventually they avoid it at, at, at all cost and that's why people would attend you know a mosque or a temple or a church building when everyone's together but when it comes to to prayer meetings everyone stays home and prayer meetings have become in the Christian community basically relegated to a few old ladies who got nothing else to do we call them intercessors by the way uh, I've discovered in scripture that there is no ministry called the ministry of intercession it doesn't exist in scripture the Bible says all men ought to pray and not not cease so even you know appointing a few people to pray in the church while the rest of us go and play football or you know play golf is not scriptural everyone should pray but the problem is if you don't get results then you quit I was the same way all of us if we honest we prayed for years in our lives and saw no results and that discourages the human spirit and there are people watching this program and I know what you're going through you know you you don't go to prayer meetings because it doesn't seem to work and that's normal but the reason I believe it doesn't work is because of the word you used earlier you said this book teaches principles and that's the key matter of fact the word key is what it's all about Jesus said in Matthew 16 I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven he says for it is given to you whatever you bind on earth with these keys heaven will bind whatever you open on earth heaven will open now at this point I just want to focus on the word keys keys means principles you know keys are used to 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 give you authority to give you access to give you power to give you control over something if I give you my keys to my car, you control my car. If I give you the keys to my house, you have power over my house. If I give you keys to my, to my home, you have access to my house anytime. So when Jesus says, I give you the keys, plural, of the kingdom, we have to learn all of these principles. The principle of prayer is something you've got to learn so you can have access to heaven, control over what happens on earth, to impact what happens.